Hey friends, welcome back. Today we're going to be playing a full demo of Potion Permit. It's created by Mass Hive Media and the planned release date is September 22nd, 2022. So we're going to go ahead and get started and play it, see how it is. Um, apparently a bunch of people have a, like different ailments that you have to create potions for and make sure that you cure them with the potions so that's that should be pretty cool i i tend to like games that you can collect and build and create things so let's go ahead and i like all the cus the character customization i like this a lot we'll go with this skin tone right here i like that hairstyle it's cute hair color and they have blue so that's cute yeah we're gonna go with that blue i wish they had darker blue but you know can't be too picky eye color we're gonna go with green we'll go with that one that's pretty outfit color Ooh, that's cute oh my gosh is that oh my gosh that's like Bulma okay okay we're gonna go with that one right there cape color huh what color we want our cape probably blue huh green yeah I think the blue that it was was good let's see okay so we're not gonna be named Logan we're gonna be named Fristal there we go there's our character. Name can't be changed later. That's fine with me. We are fine with being Crystal. A train. Okay. Similar to uh, Little Witch in the Woods. With the train. We have a doggo. That's cute. Ah, excuse me. Fristel, it's me, Dr. Nestor, from the Medical Association. I'm on our way to meet our colleagues on Moonberry Island. The Association HQ asked me to say hello to you, since we're taking the same train. <laughs> oh my, I didn't realize you were bringing your dog along. Isn't he adorable? What's his name? His name is Momo. Such an adorable name. Are you going to help out on Fristel's important assignment, Momo? <laughs> We're almost at Moonberry Station. While you're on the island, you'll be representing the Medical Association. Do you have everything in order? Yes, I do. This is a valuable opportunity for us. We're all counting on you. If you're successful, we may finally be allowed to establish a branch on the island. Here we are. Let's get going. Oh, the way the dog walks is funny. I like our little cape. It's cute. We're, our character's so cute. And a little doggo. This is it, Fristel. Moonberry Island. Oh, wow. They came out to greet us and everything. Look at that. Cape boys. And here are our colleagues. Please allow me to introduce Moira and Colin. Hi. Nice to meet you. You must be the new chemist. We've already talked to the mayor. He's waiting for you up ahead by the town gate. The association is counting on you. Don't let us down. Oh, don't let her worry you. Hey, you brought along your medical journal, right? Remember to check and update it regularly. And make sure to be polite and helpful. You're the association's first representative here. Well, you'd better get going. Good luck, Bristol. Why is she mean? Do you think Fristo will manage on her own? I have my doubts. Oh, but I'm excited to see what happens. Colin's a cutie. He can stay. Let's head back to the capital. Those butterflies are cute. There's the mayor. Oh, she's walking with some sass. Fristo, we've been expecting you. Allow me to welcome you to Moonberry. 
My name is Meyer, and I'm the mayor. This is my wife, Mariel. It's an absolute pleasure to meet you. It was me who sent that letter to the capital. You see, our daughter needs help. Our Rue has been feeling off color for a very long time. We've been trying to find a cure for her, but as yet to no avail. But with your help, we hope she'll get better. Oh dear. Anyway, Rue is currently being seen by Moonberry's local witch doctor. It will be some time before she returns. But before that, I should tell you a little about Moonberry's previous dealings with chemists from the capital. Would you be so kind as to come with us? Before I explain everything, I'd like to introduce you to everyone. Good evening, everyone. We've come together tonight to welcome a guest. Please allow me to introduce Fristel. Fristel is a chemist sent by the Medical Association. As you are all aware, our daughter has been sick for a long time. My wife and I are still trying to find a cure for her illness. With that in mind, we sought assistance from the capital. I hope you all give Fristel a warm welcome. A chemist? I see. Never thought I'd see another chemist in our town. We know you're desperate for a cure, but you might want to watch who you bring in, Meyer. A chemist? Well, shiver me timbers. I have crewmates more competent than this year, novice. Nobody from the capital can be trusted. Have you forgotten what they did? Now, now, won't anyone make a newcomer feel welcome? Please forgive us. Everyone is just a little excited. Mm, excited is not quite the word there. Now, if you'd like to follow me, I'll show you to your lodgings. This old building used to be our previous chemist's house. Its former owner moved away a long time ago. Now that it's empty, you can take it over. I realize it might seem rather odd to you that not everyone here is overjoyed about your presence. We have rather a history of incidents involving the medical association. Our relationship has been rather disastrous so far. I imagine they haven't told you a single word about all this in the capital. You'll learn more about it as you discover the island. Let's come back to all this after you've rested, shall we? And please don't forget our request. Our daughter needs your help. I'll see you tomorrow, Fristel. Good night. Sleep well. Oh. Wow. That was loud. <laughs> you can move your character around freely. While you are running, your dog will follow you wherever you go. Sadly, he's not allowed to come inside the house. You can interact with some of the obstacles around you. You will see a sign whenever you are close to any interactable object. When you are close to multiple interactable objects, you can navigate between them. Huh. Got a box? You can decorate your room with the available furniture. Try to interact with the floor plan object to start decorating your room. You can acquire more furniture by purchasing them from the bulk and build. Okay. Let's see what we got. Any newly acquired furniture will be registered here for decoration purposes. You're not allowed to place any furniture that might block your path between your bed and the door. Try rotating the furniture to fit it in the space available in your room. Okay, so let's see. We have a table, so we'll select that. Oh, I guess we don't have any tables. Do we have any chairs? We have a broken sofa. We'll put that there. It's nasty. Do we have any lighting? No. Decoration? No. Mist. Okay. There we go. There's our nasty ass bedroom, I guess. Ugh, this house is gross. Go answer the door. Good morning, Fristel. I trust you slept well. Who dead next to you? Allow me to introduce Zhao, my assistant. Hi, Zhao. Very nice to meet you. I work with Mayor Meyer at the town hall. I was hoping the two of you would get along. If there's anything you need, Zhao will be able to assist you. As it's your first day, I'd like you to start getting to know our island. I've asked one of our rangers to meet you near Meadow Range and show you the ropes. To get there, cross the bridge to the south, then head east. He also has some things prepared for you. Well, you'd better be off. Our ranger forest is waiting for you as we speak. Your highlighted quest will be shown at the top right of the screen. You can highlight another quest on the quest page located in your journal. The mini map at the top right of the screen shows quest objectives as icons. You can enlarge the map to view all the quests available around the island. Okay, that's cool. So our first task is to go to Meadow Range Entrance. Alright, so let's get going, I guess. 
so we need to cross this bridge and then go east. Going east now. Meadow Range. Hey there, you must be the chemist. My name's Forrest. Mayor Meyer said you'd be coming this way. I've got a little something for you. Call it a welcome gift. You might need it because I've got an errand for you. I want you to gather me some herbs. I'm sure you know how, right? By the way, the mayor probably told you. An accident in the past killed off many of our native plants. If only people from the capital worked responsibly, tragedies like that wouldn't happen. Oops! Me and my big mouth. Once you're done, head back to my cottage. I'll see you there. Ooh, he wants us to go back to his cottage. All right. That's all for now. Good luck out there, chemist. Swing your tools at gathering points to forage resources. Gathering points are indicated by glowing sparks. Stamina is consumed each time you use a tool. Make sure you use the correct tool to gather resources. You can switch between sickle, hammer, and axe. You can avoid incoming attacks by rolling. Rolling does not consume stamina, but you will have to catch your breath after successive rolls. Let's get our sickle out. So we got one daisy so far. Got some iron ore. Get some mushrooms. Fight that boy. Oh! Jeez. Chop that tree down. Getting some of that ore while we can. Oh, look at that right there. Meadow Range Experiment Day 1. I, Dr. Samuel, have been appointed to lead research team for this area. Moonberry's soil is indeed very unique. The Meadow Range area is extremely green and boasts a great deal of unique vegetation. I've observed many trees and animals thriving in this beautiful ecosystem. We are planning to take some soil samples and attempt to study the soil's reactions. If we succeed in this research, this will be a big step forward for the capital and Moonberry citizens. The land's fertility will increase and vegetation will grow faster. We will do all we can to see our mission through. Page missing on all of that. Okay. Alright. Well. Oh! Bear boy. No. No, no, no. That bear is terrifying. You will encounter resources that require better foraging tools. Your tools will be slightly inefficient and require you to spend more effort to gather materials. Each of your tools can be upgraded at hearts and sparks. With more powerful tools, it'll be easier for you to gather materials. Okay, that was lemon balm, so we don't need that. Let's see about this. What's this? Ha, he's stuck. He's trying to chase me and he can't. Oh, it's just a tougher thing. Okay, so we got one basil. Okay, so we got the basil. Now we need the jasmine. I really don't know where to get that from. Jeez. Still trying to find some jasmine. Dang, I really cannot find this jasmine. Let's try this way. There we go! Oh my gosh, dude. I looked everywhere for that. Boy, bye. Oh, I don't want no, no bears. Alright, now we need to go to the ranger post. Stop wasting time in here. It's getting late because I've sat around trying to find that freaking jasmine for so long. So let's go ahead and go back to the ranger. Go into the ranger post. Did you find everything I asked for? 
Yes, sir. Good job. I have to admit I'm surprised. Now that you've completed your first task, I've got a new one for you. Find Zhao. He'll be waiting for you at the town hall. You know where the town hall is, right? Don't keep him waiting. Nice. Now we go find Zhao. Says we need to get to him between 18 and 17. And... I don't know. It's getting a bit late. We I hope we can make it in time. We made it in time. Cool. You're here, so you passed the first test with flying colors. Looks like I'll have to raise my expectations a little. Oof. And now let me introduce you to Runeheart. So, you're the chemist. I've asked Runeheart to repair the cauldron in your house. Let's head over there together now. So this is the old rusty thing that needs to fix up? That's right, can you do it? Piece of cake. Sorry about the mess in the house, jeez. Just inviting people over willy-nilly, look at that. It's nasty. Wow, she made that much better. She's all ready for you. Well, that's me done. Take good care of her, okay? Well, now you've got yourself a working cauldron. Let's make some potions. I'm sure that won't be a problem. You are a chemist after all, right? If you need more materials, you'll find plenty of resources around Meadow Range. Once you're done, you can meet me at the town hall. Now, if you'll excuse me. Cauldron unlocked. So we need to craft a neutralizing herbal balm and a wound cleanser. The cauldron is a main tool you'll use to brew potions. To start creating a potion, you'll need a potion recipe. You can also upgrade your cauldron to increase its capacities. So we can make this neutralizing herbal balm. Let's see the recipe. Five times craft to unlock. Okay. Each potion has a different puzzle shape that must be filled in. Mix and match the puzzle pieces using the materials available to you. Placing puzzle pieces that do not fit the required shape is not allowed. The potion recipes have restrictions on the ingredients you can use. The circle frame next to the cauldron indicates the maximum quantity of materials you can use. If you exceed the maximum amount, you won't be able to start brewing. What potion? So we're making a wound cleanser. Put that there. We'll put that there. That there. And there we go. Let's start brewing it. Cool, we got wound cleanser done. Let's go ahead and craft neutralizing herbal balm. I'll place this right here. Yeah. Yeah. Put that there. Put that right there. And then we'll do another one right here. And then we need one standing up. do a fire. There we go. Start brewing. Yeah! We'll start brewing it. Neutralizing herbal balm. Alright. We finished both of them. That's cool. So now we have to go to the town hall between 8 and 17. So sadly we can't go to the town hall right now but maybe we can go ahead and explore just a little bit more hey what's that i'm sorry burp i didn't mean to stop you in your work he's doing important work so let's go explore just a little bit we're gonna look around see if there's anyone to talk to who's this guy people make mistakes i know you can do better don't push yourself too hard fishing Super rod. Okay. Hey, friend. Olive. 
Chemists are expected to help people, not spend the day chatting. Leave, would you? Oh, jeez. Cassandra, it seems that no one trusts you, chemist. Please be careful. Why is she mean? It's getting late. We'll go ahead, go home. Can't wait to make my house look better. Alright, let's open this, and I guess we're gonna go ahead and sleep. So, now we have to wait till 8 o'clock to go fulfill Zhao's request. I'll go ahead and head over there, though. Because, you know, you never know what we may find. All oh, the duckies. Wow, this is cute. This is a super cute game. Comes out in September, so that's pretty cool. We don't have to wait too long. Hi, friend! You're just a little spoiled graduate from the capital. All title, no skill. Come back again after you've shown us what you're really made of, kiddo. Oof, they are rough. All right, it's eight o'clock. We can go inside now. Are you done with my request? Yes, sir. Well, well, not bad, Fristel. I guess the medical association really has sent us a decent chemist this time. We haven't had one round here since the accident. Anyway, I shall put together a report for Meyer. I'm sure he'll be pleased. The mayor's expecting a lot of you, Fristel. That's all for today. We'll continue tomorrow. Cool. His request is completed. So now we'll go. We don't have anything to do because we have to continue tomorrow. We'll go collect in the mountains. See all about that. That should be fun. If I can ever find my way there. Gosh, I'm so bad. Okay. Jeez, I'm so bad at direction made it to meadow range cool so now we're just gonna do a little bit of extra farming and everything just so that we get resources and don't waste our day I wonder if we get like a sword eventually Ooh. cool we're getting a lot of resources we still have a good deal of stamina too this game's really fun. I wish I could play more of it and that this wasn't just the demo because I know it's ending and that's gonna freaking suck. Woo! Spicy boy. I like that you can fight in this game too. That's pretty cool. Not that I'm very good, but it is cool that they have other elements and things that you can get. If you run out of stamina, you won't be able to use any tools. Your running speed will also be decreased. Eating the consumables in your bag will recover your stamina. It can also be recovered by sleeping at home or having a bath in the Willow Waters bathhouse. Alright, so we'll go have a bath. We'll make our way back. Let's go collect. We're going to collect some of the other plants that were up here, and then we'll go have a... Actually, we'll just go to sleep, to be honest. Let's try and beat this bear. Ah! Ooh, we got a bear's claw and honey. That's cool. Okay, let's go ahead and go on home. We collected a good bit of stuff, so that's cool. Because at least when they ask us to complete more potions, we'll have some. We'll have, we'll have like... We collected a good bit of stuff. We're on the way out of here. We're leaving. Gonna make our way back to the house, go to sleep, and then wake up and do Zhao's request. Your dog will occasionally tell you how he feels. You can see this by the emoticon sometimes shown above his head. You'll need to whistle for your dog before interacting with him, but you won't be able to whistle for him when he's too far away. Your dog loves food, and loves to be petted. By feeding and petting your dog, your bond with him will start to grow. He is a loyal and helpful pet, especially when you develop a close bond. Let's pet him. And then... He's hungry, so let's feed him... We'll feed him a mushroom. There you go, buddy. Alright open this up 
And we're gonna go ahead and go to sleep. All right. It's the next day. Let's go ahead and go talk to Zhao. Oh, they're here already. Fristel, Rue's back. We've taken her to the empty clinic. That's, I would not take my child there. Come quickly, follow me. Look at the burb. Look at the burb. Oh my gosh, he's just hopping. He's like, hello, I have something to say. Come quickly, follow me. He looks like Dracula. Meyer, Fristel, here she is. Would you please check her over? Who is this? What are you doing here? Mateo, this is Fristel, the chemist from the capital. Fristel, this is Mateo, Moonberry's witch doctor. What is the meaning of this? You brought someone over from the capital? Mateo, let's discuss this later. First, you have to explain what happened to Rue. We still don't know what's wrong with her. I tried everything I could, but it wasn't enough. Fristel, is there anything you can do? Please help my daughter. My neck feels weird. Whenever an unknown symptom appears on a patient's body, you will identify it first through diagnosis. Once you've performed the diagnosis successfully, you will know which disease the patient has. So her neck feels weird. The goal of this minigame is to press the button that appears, landing on the right button and within the hitbox. You will lose progress bar points if you press the wrong button or press outside the hitbox. Your performance during the minigame will affect your patient's satisfaction level. So it looks like it's the arrow keys. Okay, so... Side, up, side, down. Oh my gosh, there's a lag on it. Oh my gosh, there's a lag. This minigame's trash. They better let me retry that. So it said arrow keys, but what it really meant was the W A S D ones. So let's go ahead and restart that because that was awful. So Wow. Cool. Finally, I just really thought it was the arrow keys. I was like, how the fuck am I missing everything? How is she? Will she be alright? The sunworm symptom. Yes, that's one of the symptoms, but the disease is far more complicated than we thought. You want to help? I won't let that happen. We shouldn't use any unnatural drugs on Rue. But if it might help my daughter, please do anything you deem necessary for her sake, Crystal. Rue is still weak, Meyer. My advice is that we should use our traditional methods to find a cure. Using unnatural drugs from the capital might have side effects we're unaware of. He's got a point, but no. But if they cure my daughter, besides, Fristel can only use ingredients available on the island to cure her. If that's what you think is best, dear. Do you really believe that? If you mess this up, you'll pay the price. Ooh, threat! Do whatever you can for her, Fristel, please. Craft Moonbrine. So, we're gonna go ahead and craft Moonbrine, I guess. Craft. Moon Brian. Let's see what we can do here. Do that one. We'll do two of that. And then, is there one with three across? The bear paw has three across. There we go. Let's start brewing. Heck yeah. Moonbrine. Apply Moonbrine to Rue. Let's go make this girl better. There we go. Treatment completed. I doubt I can go home in this condition. Are you sure? Rue, my dear, are you feeling any better? Yes, I think so. Thank goodness. Oh, my little girl, you're finally cured. Do you feel strange at all, Rue? No, Mama, I've never felt so good. Thank you, chemist. We're profoundly in your debt. I'm glad to hear that. But you, 
What exactly was in that bottle? You must have given her some suspicious stuff. There's no way she could have been cured this fast. Still lying, I see. I'll expose your little scheme. Now, now, Mateo, if Frisil is here to help Rue, why can't we work together to find a solution? But this kid's from the capital. Have you forgotten what they did to our island? Certainly not, but times have changed. After all, I'm the one asking for help. You're just too impatient, Mayor. We tried all sorts of methods to cure her, but nothing worked. And if change can make everyone's lives better, who am I to refuse it? I'm disappointed in you. If my commitment to this community means nothing to you, feel free to ask this capital lackey for assistance. Just don't come running to me for help. Ooh, he's a grumpy one. He's sassy. It's alright. He used to be such a pleasant chap. I'm afraid he seems to have taken a dislike to you. He is a very idealistic person. Mariel, you'd better be off home and let Rue get some rest. Alright, darling. Have a good rest, dear. Yes, Mama. Since Rue will be in the clinic for a while, please keep an eye on her. And I shall send a letter to the Medical Association about your accomplishment. I'm sure they'll be happy to know how things are progressing. Well, I think we're done here. I shall see you again soon. Nice, we completed the quest. Now what? Hello, what do now? Uh, I don't know if it's okay to talk to you right now. Everyone has told me not to. Chemist, right? Show me you're good enough, then we'll speak. Oof. I really don't know what to do. We're actually gonna try and switch it to the next day and see if maybe we can get some quests going, something. Bulletin board. This board displays any information of interest around Moonberry, like friendship events. An icon will be displayed over the board when something's new to check out. There are several identical boards around town you can view. Alright, there's nothing. Let's go sleep this day off. We'll see if we can get another quest now. There we go. Good morning! Some people from the medical association have arrived at the town hall. They want to discuss something with you. There you are! I wasn't expecting you to be able to cure the mayor's daughter so fast. I must say we were rather surprised at your achievements. I have brought you all here simply to discuss what's next. Yes, I'm aware of that. Could you give us a little more explanation? As you're aware, your chemist successfully cured my daughter. But now I've realized that what happened to Rue could happen to any of my citizens. Our knowledge here is very limited. And that is precisely why we need a person like you, Fristel, to assist us with your knowledge. If I'm not asking too much of you, I would like your permission to let Fristel help us for a while, so we can exchange our knowledge and strengthen the bond between Moonberry and the capital. Of course, Mayor! Our association would be glad to assist you. This cooperation could be a stepping stone for the both of us. Our priority is helping as many places as we can to stay safe and healthy. Frisco can stay here for as long as you need. Thank you. I officially grant my permission for the Medical Association's representative to reside and work in Moonberry. And I, as a delegate of the Medical Association, give Fristel a mandate to help the citizens of Moonberry starting from today. Well, this important task is now on your shoulders. Go and do what you do best. Congratulations! Cool! Promoted! Well, you must excuse us, we have a train to catch. And a report to write about this milestone. It's going to be a long report. I might have to leave it to you, Moira. Come on, Colin. It's your job. Don't be so childish. Stop bickering, you two. We need to get going. Best of luck, Fristel. Don't you let us and Moonberry down. Now, since you're officially staying here with us, we should discuss our next steps. I greatly appreciate all the effort you put in for Rue. My wife and I will be forever grateful. I shall need to make some major changes in order to prevent such diseases taking hold in Moonberry. But as you know, not all of the Moonberry residents are fond of people like you from the capital. And in order to make changes to healthcare here, we need to start changing their perspectives. We will need to work extra hard to bring them around. Some of them may be stubborn, but I assure you they are good people. Why don't you introduce yourself around the town? I'm sure they'll start to warm up to you once they know who you are. Trust reflects how well you are perceived as a chemist in Moonberry. The thumbs up icon indicates your current position of trust within the community. Having a thumbs down icon will affect the way all the villagers treat you. They won't talk to you and you won't be able to trigger any events around town. You can gain trust points by successfully treating villagers who need help. Failing on the treatments will lose you trust points. 
So, time to go introduce ourselves. All right, let's go talk to all the people. Victor. A chemist? I'm Victor. What do you want from me? Wait. Sanus seems to like you. Sanus? You can't see him, but of course. Oh, it's you. What do you need? I'm Opalheart. You might have heard my blacksmithing wares. Hello, sweetheart. I'm Helene. If you're into games, we've got some at the arcade center. Teehee. So we introduced to three people. Roll up in these people's houses. Oi, so you're the chemist? Smaller than I expected. I'm Runeheart, Moonberry's soon-to-be legendary blacksmith. Let's check this house. There's no one in that house. Okay. Okay, so this is the mayor's house. There's Rue. Good day to you, Fristel. If anyone is rude to you, don't take it personally. I hope you like the simple town. Ah, it's you! Thanks for your help back then. I'm Rue, the mayor's daughter. Nice to meet you again. Well, let's go upstairs, see what's up there. The mayor's still sleeping, I see. All the furniture and stuff is so cool. I like the animation on this. Yes, are you talking to me? Those manners are just what I would expect of someone from a dirty place like the capital. My name's Nova. With enough perseverance, I can fix your strange hair and outfit. Jeez, judgy, huh? We have three more people to talk to. Yes, I'm Yorn. I own the tavern. Come pay us a visit sometime. Good day, Fristel. Oh, how rude of me. My name's Martha. Nobody in Moonberry is unkind on purpose. Please don't worry about it. They just need some more time. One more person to talk to. Hopefully there's one. There's not another in here, I guess. Jeez. I hate introducing myself. Oh, so this is the arcade. Hi there, sweetheart. This is your first time here, isn't it? Well, welcome to the Arcade Center. Feel free to play games here when you're bored. Or maybe... You can hang out with me if you're at a loose end. Alright, let's go back to the Town Hall. Here we go, back at Town Hall. Chemist, how can I help you? I'm Zhao, I manage everything to do with community requests. I can assist you by posting them outside the Town Hall. So you've met Moonberry residents, great. Now, let's discuss the most important part, shall we? You might have seen that some of them aren't yet welcoming you with open arms. There is a reason for that. In the past, an accident occurred here that was the fault of a chemist. It did such damage to parts of the island that our native plants went extinct. In the wake of this, Moonberry banned chemists, especially chemists from the capital. Ever since, Mateo's family have been our only source of health care. Everything was going brilliantly. We didn't need chemists to live our lives well. Until one day, Rue suddenly felt ill. Mateo tried so many methods, but none of them worked. And then, that's when I realized it. There are problems we just can't solve by ourselves. Maybe we shouldn't write off a whole group just because of one person. So, I brought you here to see if you, a chemist, could in fact cure my daughter. And, just as I expected, you did. My citizens still bear the scars of what happened, but I hope you come to understand them better and regain their trust. I want to give you this. It's called an approval badge. It gives you permission to explore more of the island so you can gather more materials. I do apologize if this is all rather foreign to you. It's just one of our town's regulations. Your success in treating Rue is proof of your ability as a chemist. And if you can prove that you have other skills, I'd be happy to upgrade your badge to a higher level in the future. I'm looking forward to seeing you contribute to our town. 
cool. Approval badge one acquired. This badge can be earned as you prove yourself to be a good chemist. With this badge, you'll have access to certain areas around the island for your material needs. The only person who can promote your badge is the mayor of Moonberry. To prove yourself as a good chemist, you'll need to be assessed by the medical association. They can give you a letter of recommendation that will be useful to promote your badge. Hopefully we can get them to start liking us. Let's go see what part we unlocked. A new face! I'm Dean, a police officer here in Moonberry. Did you bring any snacks from the capital? Please let me have some. Don't tell my twin brother Derek, though. Bubble! Hey, I'm Bubble, one of Moonberry's rangers. Our duty is to watch for any trouble happening outside of town. Don't worry, I haven't spotted anything dangerous recently. Let's go see that part that they unlocked for us. Hey, what's up? Oh, it's nothing. We were just talking about all this. This landslide has been blocking the path for quite some time. We used to forge for materials further down the road, but now our access routes are pretty limited. Clearing it away? You'd be able to travel further and find more materials for your potions, I suppose. If you have supplies, maybe we could help you out. We'll need a few resources and probably a strong fishing net. How about you find someone in town who can lend us what we need? Go to the Lazy Bowl Tavern. So let's go ahead and do that. This demo is long. Hey you! What are you doing? Oh, you're that person from the capital. Welcome to my place. This is Moonberry's Tavern. We serve food and drink, and we have some arcade machines downstairs. Feel free to drop by during our opening hours. I had to leave and re-enter. I know, right? What a waste. I agree, Miss Runehart. Hey, Fristal! What were we yakking about? We were just talking about the fishing nets we got from the Primrose Sale. I'm a loyal customer. I use their nets to haul my heavy blacksmithing materials around. And our police department uses their nets to capture wild animals during patrols. They're very sturdy. Too bad their stock is always limited. I get it. It must be difficult to make such high quality nets. If only they could produce more, our lives would be much easier. I second that, Miss Runehart. You look curious, Fristel. Are you thinking about getting one? You'll have to go to the Primrose Sale, then. I doubt they have any left. Good luck. Go to Primrose Sale. Finally made it to the Primrose Sale. Welcome to the Primrose Sale. Oh, it's ye matey. What ye need? A sturdy fishing net. We're all out of stock. Don't give me that look. If you're really hankering after another one, ask Otmar on the first floor. It's him who used to make them. Maybe he's got a spare. If the tides favor ye. Our nets are pretty popular, huh? Hello, Fristo. Why are you here? You want Otmar's steel fishing nets? Many people want Otmar's nets. Otmar's so happy. But this is the last one Otmar have. Can't sell it. Maybe Fristo trade for something? Need more stock for the beach cafe. Honey and seasoning for tasty corn. Here, Otmar made list. When Fristo bring them, Otmar give last nut. Otmar will wait. Wish you luck. So, we need more honey and more mushrooms. Alright. Actually, we can't even go to the woods. It's about to be time to go back to sleep. We need to go on home. Alright, we're home. So we're gonna go ahead and go to sleep quick. Alright. Going to sleep. Now we can go ahead and go get that stuff we need. Hey, Fristel! What do you think of how the new building looks? Isn't it great? Raynar helped me install some important stuff. You hear that sound loud and clear, right? I'll sound the horn whenever one of our residents falls ill and is brought here. That way, you'll be notified when you have a new patient. Hi there, chemist. I hope you like my handiwork. I reckon I'm all done here. Time for me to go. 
Thanks for your help, Rainer. Anytime, Mayor Chemist. How wonderful that you now have a suitable space for your patients to recuperate in. I shall tell everyone to come here when they fall ill from now on. Please do treat everyone with the utmost care. I trust you, don't let me down. If you fail, well, we're all one big family here. If you hurt one of us, you hurt us all. Well, time for me to take my leave. Have a good day, Fristal. Clinic unlocked. Moonberry residents who fall ill will be brought to the clinic automatically. You'll be notified clearly by a horn sound in the morning, as well as a strobe light indicator. You can also upgrade your clinic at the bulk and build. Each upgrade will serve to benefit you and your patient. All right, time to go. Going to the forest now. We're gonna get honey and mushrooms. Cool, here's a mushroom. We need to go down here, because there's some bears over here. And another mushroom, cool. So we got all the mushrooms we need. Oof. Okay, we need one more honey. One more bear to go. There should be one around here. There we go. Woo! These boys are tough. Woo! There we go. Now we go to Otmar. Oh my gosh. And where did he go? I can't find this dude, and I've been filming for like two and a half hours now. I'm starving, so I'm so sorry. I'm not going to be able to finish this demo today, but hopefully this gave you a good look at this game. It's a pretty good game. Um, it looks like it's going to be a lot of fun. Definitely going to play. I, I did not expect the demo to be this long and have this much put into it, but it's a pretty cool game. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one. I'm not